Hey everyone, welcome to the next video of SELT SAT series. In this lesson, guys, we're discussing a topic from level one, unit one, properties of equality. Basically, you should remember that there are four properties of equality. That's the addition property, subtraction property, multiplication property, and division property. Let's discuss each of them one by one. Let me give you examples. First, let's talk about addition property. So let's say W minus six equals to nine. We need to isolate a variable W. To do this, we need to move negative six to the right side of the equation mark. As you guys know, when the number or any other element goes to the other side of the equation mark, the sign always changes. So W equals to nine plus six, which equals to 15. The second one, subtraction property. Say X plus seven equals to 11. Again, we need to find the value of the variable x. To do this, we need to move positive seven to the right side of the equation mark. Since it's got a positive sign, when we move it to the right, the sign will change to the negative. So x will be equal to 11 minus seven, which makes four. The next one, multiplication property. Say, y divided by five equals to three. Again, we need to isolate the variable y. To do this, as you can see, we need to multiply both sides of the equation mark by five. If we do this, we will get rid of the denominator. We will get y equals to three times five, which makes 15. And the last one, guys, is the division property. So let me give you another example. Eight times Z equals to 40. So uh, to be able to solve for Z, we need to get rid of eight. To get rid of eight, we need to divide both sides of the equation mark by eight. So if we divide the left side, we will get Z. If we divide the right side, we will get five. So Z equals to five. Guys, it's, it's extremely important to remember the properties of equality. If you wanna do more exercises, you can go to Celt VIP, click on the homework section and start doing the exercises. Good luck.